but I've seen it's around two, three minutes. And then you press the button again. Yep. Just count the snooze feature. Alarm. Yeah, the alarm comes back, then you have to press that button again. So now we've got, let's say that we're back to that condition. Now we want to clear this alarm out, right? Yes. So we'll cycle the key. Um, you need three consecutive trips where all of your parameters um, are within specifications. And then on the fourth one, it should be reset. So that last one that we just did counted as our first. So what could happen is you could start the bus improperly, creating this problem, start it properly the second time and still have the alarm sure. and have that for three more times. Yep. And what we're just doing is simulating three more starts so we eliminate the condition again. Yep. So here's what we do. So after your wait to start light goes inactive like it has, you'll start your bus. You'll just let it run for a couple of seconds. Doesn't need to be very long. You'll shut the bus off. Turn it to the on position again. Wait to your wait to start light to go out and your gauges to stop sweeping. So that's number two. Three. Yep, so on your fourth one, this one here, it's gone inactive off the dash. Okay. 